welcome to this new strategy video. Today I'm going to present the implementation for MetaTrader 4 of a strategy based on Donkey and Channel's breakout. Remember that you can download the source code for free from the links down below. The original strategy was created by Rene Balki on its YouTube channel. The strategy is named Donkey and Channel Scalping Strategy Explained. You will find the link to the original video on the description down below. It is basically implemented on the Donkey and Channel's indicator. He creates buy stop and sell stop orders at the channel's top and bottom levels and waits for the breakout by setting a tight take profit. In this video, I'm going to explain how I have been replicated the strategy on MetaTrader 4 and how I changed it a bit in order to reduce the risk and increment the profit. Before getting into the details, if you like this kind of content, please consider subscribing to the channel. This will encourage me to continue creating strategies and EAs. Also, if you would like me to implement a strategy you like, please, feel free to comment the video and provide me the links with the details. Following the original idea, the EA loads the donkey in channels and looks if there are the conditions to create a stop orders. They also set the initial stop loss to the opposite channel minus some delta points which can be set using the EA input variables. Whenever an order is filled, the EA waits for a take profit and closes the trade in profit. It then checks for a retracement of the price up toward the center of the channels before opening again the order on the previous direction. The EA then keeps going by creating more orders on the channel extrema and moves them accordingly to the top and bottom lines. It also recomputes the stop losses of the orders every time. As you can see from the trades report of the strategy tester, the stop orders have been continuously adapted to the channel's extrema until eventually they are filled. Once a stop order becomes a market one, the EA does not create other stop orders on the same direction but waits eventually for the trade to be in profit or stopped out on the loss. The donkey and channel indicator is quite simple. It consists of three lines, which are drawn on the same window of the chart. It has few input parameters allowing us to tweak a bit how the extrema are computed. However, for this strategy, the only one we care about is the periods, representing the number of back bars to check to compute the line levels. The levels are basically set to the lowest and highest bar between the current one and the number of bars back in the periods. So, as an example, if we set periods to 20, the upper bar will be drawn at the highest price from now and 20 bars back in the past on the current time frame. The lower bar, on the other side, will be drawn at the lowest price instead. The expert advisor, as you can see from this screenshot here, exposes only the periods parameter of the Donkian indicator. So, that means that you will need to take care only of the number of bars to take in the computation. The other parameters of the expert advisor are basically used to control the market orders. The cross anchor represents the number of points the price needs to retrace from opposite level before open a new stop order. The stop loss points represents the number of points from the opposite level to set the stop loss for a new stop order. A zero value for this parameter means set the stop loss exactly to the opposite line. The take profit points represents the fixed number of points to close the order in profit in the case the market moves to the correct direction. The trailing stop activation represents the number of points on profit to start the trailing stop. Notice that this parameter is taken into account only if the take profit points 1 is set to 0. The trailing stop delta represents the number of points on profit to jump the stop loss by in the case the price continue on the same market order direction. Like the previous one, this parameter works only if the fixed take profit are set to 0. The use external indicator parameter tells to the expert advisor whether to use the external or internal donkey and channels indicator code. Notice that the internal expert advisor function to compute the donkey and channels extrema is exactly the same of the external indicator. So, it's basically up to you choosing which one you want to enable. This one should be set to false in the case you don't have the indicator installed on your platform. The main expert advisor logic basically checks if the conditions to set new stop orders are met or not. 
To open a new buy stop order, first of all no other buy market or pending orders must be already active on the current symbol. The last trade, also, should not be more recent than 3 bars. Meaning that if you use the EA at H1, it will wait 3 hours at least before checking for a new entry. If all the previous conditions are met, the expert advisor then waits for a retracement of the price. In this case, the price should cross from above, top down, the higher channel level, minus cross anchor points. Meaning that if the previous order have been filled and the trend continues, it won't set a new stop order again until the price retrace back towards the center of the channel. Moreover, the top channel line should be stable. Meaning that no new lowers highs have been created in the meantime. Once all the conditions are valid to open a new buy stop order, it will be created by setting the stop loss to the opposite level, minus stop loss points. For a sell stop order, the conditions are basically the same of the previous one. Except we control the opposite values and movements of the price. In the case a pending order exists, the expert advisor checks whether it must be modified or not. The pending order must follow the donkey and channel line in the case it changes in the meantime. The same occurs for a sell stop order of course. That's it for today. Thanks for watching and see you soon for the next strategy. Remember that all the source code presented here can be downloaded for free from the links in the description.